in the last year I have found myself doing a new hobby and that would be jigsaw puzzles. Um, I never thought that I would actually like doing it but uh, you know I started doing one and uh, you know it's a lot of fun you know sitting there relaxing piecing together a picture I mean anyone can buy a picture in the store but uh, when you work on one frame it and hang it you know you put in a lot of work in order to do it. What I'm showing you right now is one of the ones that I've done. Uh, this was a 1,000 piece puzzle, very difficult to do, very beautiful now that it's hung. And we're going to go over here. And look at a couple of more. Uh, I was in Boston and I picked this one up, which is what started the, uh, what started the trend. Uh, this is a City of Champions puzzle. It has all the front headlines of all the Boston champions in the past 10 years. Um, not the Patriots last February. I had already bought the puzzle. Um, then I moved on to the hot air balloon, which you've already seen. Then the third puzzle I did was this hostess one. This one wasn't so hard because I had, you know, words and pictures to, to work with. So it, it really wasn't that hard. And this was a thousand pieces. Um, I think the City of Champions ones is about 500. Now this one was one of the smaller ones. Um, I'm going to turn the camera a little so you didn't see it. This is one of the smaller ones. This was only uh, 550 um, or 500. I don't remember. But a lot of the pieces, you know, the background with all the spots, pretty much every single piece looked alike. And... They're also oddly shaped. They're not your average size puzzle pieces there, you know. So that was very difficult, but, you know, picture is well worth it. But uh, what I'm most proud of is this one over here that I had just completed yesterday. And it took me six months. I started this one in uh, November, early November. And um, I finished it yesterday, May 12th. Um, this puzzle was 2,000 pieces. Um, it's a picture of a train, as you can see, and look at all those pieces that make up the train. Um, it kind of reminds me of a Thomas Kincaid painting, I mean, with the colors and, you know, if you go over here to the skyline, you know, that's just the light bulb, so, reflecting. Get a nice church, cabin, you know. Nice little pond where the kids are fishing. Cute little dog. But uh, yeah, 2,000 pieces. I worked on it little by little, and I've wanted to give up many times, but you know, this was very hard and well worth it now that it's framed and ready to be hung. And now I'll be working on my next challenge. Challenges. They will be three different puzzles, all 1,000 pieces, and it will take up the dining room. And the theme will be Chris's Bar. And I'll have more on that when it's done.